Okay. Little trial and tribulation, and we got the pigs in their little pen. Actually, wasn't too bad. Got them in the trailer, and then we got them in here. As you can see, I got the electric going there on a solar panel. And the pigs are learning right now to stay away from that little electric wire. Well, I know some folks might think that's kind of mean, but after a week or two and the pigs are used to that wire, they won't touch it again. At that point, they can become far more free ranging than they are right here. Right now they've got 32 by 16. They're one, one hog panel wide and two hog panels long, so that's 32 by 16. And this is going to be their little home. About a week or two. They'll eat all this grass down and there'll be nothing left. And by that time they should be trained to the wire. At which point I can then run the wire all the way around this weedy looking area weedy looking to you but lots of good food and nutrition for the pigs they like to eat stuff that grows on the ground there's a lot of grass here and they like grass see how they're kind of in the middle they're learning right now they're figuring it out with that little wire little white wire is no fun they'll get it figured out I gotta get them some water Well, you can see there they are little pot bellies but they don't like me right now because I took them out of their little home with the chickens and they can no longer live with the chickens when they were babies it was okay <coughs> the chickens taught them a lot but now they're, they're bigger and they need they need their own space and they need to be out doing pig things, not thinking they're chickens. And besides, they get a little rowdy and they're bigger and they can hurt my girls. They're kind of cute though, aren't they? Where's she at there? The sun's. You guys gonna do? You gonna go in your new little pig home? Got some apples and some feed there. Yeah, see, they're gonna just lay down in the grass. They'll be happy here for a while, but once all the grass is gone, they'll want out. But by then, they'll have figured that little white wire out. And what I'll end up doing is taking down these hog panels, seeing if they escape. And I don't think they, well, they shouldn't. We'll see. Anyway, there they go. Piggies. Big pig. Big pig. Big pig. Big pig. Hey, listen. This will be there in the little house. And there's our water bucket. But I'll get some... I'll get some uh, shavings to put in there. So they got something to nestle up in. I'll put them about a half a bale in the back and they can figure it out. Anyway, there you go, folks. Put this back on. There's a charger. She's all charged up. 100%. There's the solar panel. There's the trailer we brought them in. A couple extra hog panels over there I used to kind of corral them through. Yeah. 
I would have liked to video the whole thing, but it was me and uh, me and the chicken wrangler JJ over there. So we had our hands full. He's over in a truck right now. I don't know what he's doing. Little kid stuff. There we go, folks. A couple of pigs, pot bellies, laying down in the grass. They seem to be happy. Well, I'll be checking out on them throughout the day. And right now, I gotta go get them some water. So, there you go. There are the pigs. Do an update later. Later on.